Former President Donald Trump is suing ABC News and anchor George Stephanopoulos alleging defamation. The suit follows comments made during an interview in which Stephanopoulos repeatedly said Trump had been found liable for rape. During the interview on this week back on March 10th, Stephanopoulos pressed Republican Representative Nancy Mace regarding her continued support of Trump despite allegations of sexual abuse against him. Stephanopoulos asserted multiple times that Trump was found liable for rape in the E. Jean Carroll case. Mace defended her stance and highlighted the jury's decision was in a civil case, not a criminal one. Mace, a rape survivor, further expressed frustration at being questioned about her political choices on the topic. And you've endorsed Donald Trump for president. Mm -hmm. uh, judges and two separate juries have found him liable for rape and for defaming the victim of that rape. How do you square your endorsement of Donald Trump with the testimony we just saw? Well, I will tell you, I was raped at the age of 16. Um, and any rape victim will tell you, I've lived for 30 years with a, an incredible amount of shame over being raped. I didn't come forward because of that judgment and shame that I felt. And um, it's a shame that you will never feel, George. And I'm not going to sit here on your show and be asked a question meant to shame me about another uh, potential rape victim. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do that. It's, it's actually not about shaming you, it's a question about no, Donald Trump. No, you are Trump. shaming You've me. You've endorsed Donald Trump for president. Right. Donald Trump has been found liable for rape by a jury. Donald Trump has been found liable for defaming the victim of that rape by a jury. It's been affirmed by a judge. It was he not a criminal the, court case, was, number one. Number two, I live with shame. And you're asking me a question about my political choices, trying to shame me as a rape victim, and I find it disgusting. In 2023, a New York federal jury determined that Trump was liable for sexual abuse and defamation, not for rape. Trump's lawsuit filed in Florida claims Stephanopoulos' statements were false and made with malicious intent. Despite requests for a retraction, ABC News failed to apologize or correct the record. Trump's legal team has requested a jury trial and ABC News has not yet commented on the lawsuit. This isn't the first time Trump has taken legal action against the media. He recently faced a setback and was ordered to pay $392,000 in attorney fees to the New York Times for a failed defamation lawsuit.